what's good homo squad it's your boy homo ziggy we back here with another reaction and today it's been a little minute since we came to his channel and done the reaction funny but we got crypt still rapping from my closet official music video on take now anytime when a rapper does a one take on something and times out of ten they be fire so just turn up the speaker just a little bit on this one so hey enough talking and such and to be honest before i go into the video i ain't gonna lie it's been a little like i said it's been a little minute since i've reacted to crip and such so and the, i think the last time that i ever reacted to him was on his album that he released year like a year back and such so if you see this my bro you see this man because i know i got i know i'm gonna tag you in this video see this hope you're not hope you don't get mad that i haven't reacted to you for a little while but this might with this reaction it probably gonna get me back into reacting to you. so like i said we about to check this out make sure you like comment and subscribe hit me up on my socials up there and without further ado let's get into the video They had the writer's block and such, so now they see this clicks uh, it up. Yeah, still rapping from the closet three years later, where the time goes. Still glad I didn't take that deal, I made a lot of dough. Still trimming grass, short as fuck, sleeps are lurking low. Still middle fingers to the critics, yeah, they know a fight. Bought my crib, bought my neighbors, just like I said, that I do. Everything I spit inside these raps is nothing but the truth. Think that and he has. It's basically like this. Whatever this man says, because remember, he said he was going to want to build a career for him. Feel a crib for his peoples? He did. So, he bought his crib. I bought my crib, bought my neighbors, just like I said that I do. Everything I spit inside these raps is nothing but the truth. Think that I exaggerate, of course you do, but that's okay. I did everything you said I couldn't do. Now what's your plan? Buried alive, just got a four out of ten. I'm about to celebrate this win. It's them bitches again. Who fuckers think that your opinion matters? Well, think again. You don't know ten of your friends. Circle jerking in my pen. I'm missing <laughs> in. Damn. <laughs> Guys, let's... Ooh. And a four out of ten that's kind of weird but then again let's face it you're gonna get a lot of people who's gonna say about a certain album that especially if it's like crips album where you where they say about how that I, that your album got four out of ten that means you suck and such but then again at the end of the day guess what it be it be those same type of people who when they talking shit and such they talk shit in front of your face, right? But online. But they don't want to say that shit to your face. So. Y'all could just say where y'all at while I'm just keep still here making this money. Buried alive, just got a four out of ten. I'm about to celebrate this win. It's the bitches again. Who fuckers think that your opinion matters? Well, think again. You don't know ten of your friends. Circle jerking to my pen. I'm missing in. Crypt is dissing us. He's really pissed again. And that's so crazy. Let's be honest. Like there was a lot, that's a lot of people who do that. Like in order to get, in order to satisfy their type of clout chasing and such, that you gotta diss somebody, especially about their grandma. And like I said, and with that being said, if I'm not mistaken, Crip, if you do see this, my boy, because I know I'm gonna tag you, but if you actually do see this. Rest in peace to your grandma, but it's so crazy that there will be people actually stoop to that type of level in order to gain clout and such, to gain some kind of recognition, recognition or so in their miserable lives that they want to stoop so low into insulting another person's it's these family member just so they can get their names mentioned in a song or whatnot. That's when you know sometimes with people, you don't. Know, Someone knows us, we should say some shit again. Say something about his grandmama that really digs in him. Man, all ideas are more dead than her. Fuck out my DMs. I don't think I ain't remember compliments behind the scenes. Then I see you trashing me and with an alternate ID. I know I like to say that I don't give a fuck, but that's a lie. Kinda care too much, that's why I hope you motherfuckers die. Yeah. Go be smoke, you know I'm better than the rest. Even without my end game, that still means that I'm the best. I got more bars than a motor sick. You know I'm as cold as it is. Rope and touch and couldn't touch the bro, so frozen with this. Going toe to toe will be the first mistake you made was thinking you could set to my face I don't discriminate, black, white, Asian, not a muck Not afraid to wreck a race, figure eight, pile up Spit shit as hard as stone, but people take 
take it for granted My life is crazy, not a second's gone the way that I planned it Cause I don't limit my challenges, bro, I challenge my limits The rest of y'all be scared to take that leap of faith So good riddance, cause I don't fuck with you That's true, a lot of people Look, sometimes you gotta take risk in order to get the rewards But then again, people don't wanna take that risk They always wanna It's basically like this They don't wanna take any type of risk and such but to get that reward and most of the times do you know how many people out there actually try to survive off of them risks risk risks risks i don't know how to say that word but majority of what i'm trying to say is like nigga if you want to get where people like crip is at where they can be able to buy a crip for themselves like for no mortgage or like for no rent or apartment or anything like that if you want the finer things in life Work for the shit. Stop complaining. Stop bitching. And stop being an ass. Stop being a keyboard warrior. And actually go earn that shit for yourself. So that way. You don't have to be green with envy and such. Be green with money. Not green with envy. Simple as that. But then again let's face it. You got some people there who don't know the meaning of the word. Work. So. Hey. You want to stay there in your little keyboards and such and types all types of i don't think all this that bitch at the end of the day he's that person he's working what are you doing your second mistake the first mistake you made was thinking you could set to my face i don't discriminate black white asian line them up not afraid to wreck a race figure rate pile up spin shit as hard as stone but people take it for granted my life is crazy not a second's gone the way that i planned it because i don't limit my challenges bro i challenge my limits the rest of y'all be scared to take that leap of faith so good riddance because i don't fuck with y'all quick to treat you like a straight to thread you know i'll cut you off life is hard so tough and up young young because you fucking saw it's like you purposely try to miss my bar so you duck and fall but every time i rap it's like they leave the fucking oven on and nothing coming in this bitch i'm the boogeyman got him under covers in this bitch hot and open now here i'm fucking mumbling this shit but i smell the fear upon him like they tumble in this shit but tumble in this bitch i can make a fumble with the bricks rumble with the crib then you six feet under when the dish rolls hey. Like a little callback to I'm guessing this is like a little callback from didn't, didn't he do rapping from a closet? Cause since this ain't still rapping from a closet, Crip, if you see this, what just answer anything what I've been saying in this video, my boy. If you can't remember all of it. <laughs> Sometimes I don't even remember what I mostly say in my reactions after when I do watch them. But regardless. If I'm not mistaken, that's probably a callback to rapping from my closet, the first one and such. I'm guessing that since this is part two, you can say. And if it is, that's a good way to a hey, call back and such. I'm in this bitch. I'm the boogeyman. Got him under covers in this bitch. Hot and open now. Here I'm fucking mumbling this shit. But I smell the fear upon him like they tumbled in this shit. I'm pumping in this bitch. I can make him fumble with the bricks. Rumble with the crib. Then you six feet under when the dish rough and you get hit. Leave you fucking stumble in this shit. Hop up with the licks. It's time the cookie crumbles when you crib. Overthinking is a bitch. Honestly, I'm exhausted. So before I stop this music and they lay me in my coffin, I'ma give it all I got. It really got another option. Still rapping from my heart. Still rapping from my closet, bitch. Make sure to check that out when it comes out. This little ad right here. But hey, like I said, it's been a little minute since I've come back to Crip and such, cause like I said, it's been a while. Well then again, right? Not to say he hasn't dropped any music since then, but it's like the first time in a while I've, I've reacted to so I can't say it's been a while since he dropped music because it's been a while since I've reacted to it such. But hey, either way, sometimes it's good to come back to the ones that we've reacted to most and such, especially Crip, because at the end of the day, man spits fire as hell. But either way, shout out to Crip, my guy. See that you have more music coming on the way. So hey, like that Friday the 13th one that comes out, Lash Out. So hey, I'm all up for it. But either way, Hopefully y'all enjoyed this reaction and such. And if you made it to the end, comment down below. Comment down below risk and reward.
and that makes me know you made it this far. But it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive, keep the vibes up. Check out my other channels right here. Channels reactions right here. Lego. <laughs>